Hello, this is Minister William, or Reverend Will, if you wish, and this is the sermon for June 25th, 2023. And as always, we'll start with a moment of silence for prayer, meditation, what have you. All right, thank you. Today's sermon is called Two Cats and a Monkey. And as always, it is on alltimeshortstories.com. Or as usual, it's a child, it's an old children's story. After a lavish festival in a village, two cats were prowling together. One of the cats saw a delicious looking cake and meowed. The other jumped up and picked it up. Picked it. The first cat said, It is my cake because I saw it first. The other cat said, It is my cake because I picked it up. A monkey was passing by when it overheard the two cats fighting for their share of the cake. The monkey thought to take advantage of the cat's fight and approach the two cats. It came to the cat and said, Don't fight, my friends. I have two hands. I can easily divide the cake into two pieces. Let me equally share the cake among you both. The cats agreed and handed the cake over to the monkey. The monkey split the cake into two parts. He shook his head and said, Oh, no. One is slightly bigger than the other. Let me take a bite of the bigger one so that it is as big as the other one. He had a big bite of the bigger piece and said, Oh no, it has become smaller now. He ate the other, and thus he went on eating from part to part until he finally finished the whole cake. When all the cake was all over, the cats were stunned by the happening. It was very late when they realized that the monkey was making fools out of them the entire time. Moral. When you quarrel and fight, someone else gains. When brothers fight to death, a stranger inherits the property. African proverb. Too many people these days are uh, fighting amongst themselves, being stupid. You can mostly uh, see this uh, when it comes to political groups. You have Democrats fighting Republicans, fighting Democrats, uh, liberals fighting conservatives, conservatives fighting liberals. And everybody suffers except for, you know, the high ups of those groups and the wealthy and whatever. The world is keeping divided because everyone's fighting over stupid stuff. Stuff that they could easily put aside and work out. But they fight about it because people tell them to fight about it. And they all lose. And somebody, the person who has taken advantage of them, wins. What you need is not to fight over stupid things. Work out your problems. Because the person who is always, there's usually a person putting you and the person you're fighting with against each other. And they're the ones getting the, all this, getting everything out of, of it. You can't let them do that. Step back and ask yourself and the person you're fighting with, is this really worth it? What are we fighting for? What do we gain from this? 
you don't gain anything, try to figure out who is gaining from your fight. But, uh, it is very hot. And, uh, hopefully, the next uh, summer has officially began. So, hopefully, soon it will be cooled down. And, uh, yeah. Remember, everyone, when we all come together, the possibilities are endless. And I'll see you next week. Bye.